There are not many things better in this world than an incredibly moist, super fudgy, intensely chocolatey brownie. Hi guys, I'm Madeline here at Lakeside Table. And if you like to eat absolutely delicious food without a lot of hassle in making it, then definitely go ahead and hit that subscribe button because that is exactly what we do here. And right now, we're doubling down on the chocolate with this amazingly rich and fudgy brownie. Okay guys, first things first, mise en place. Go ahead and get all your ingredients together. Now, if you are the superstar that I know you are, don't just get your ingredients out, go ahead and get your ingredients measured out. It makes cooking so much easier and so much more funner. And this brownie recipe is just as easy to make as it is decadent to eat. I'm just saying, it's that good. Start by sifting together the flour, cocoa, and salt. Then whisk together the melted butter, sugar, eggs, and vanilla. Next, gently stir the flour mixture into the wet ingredients. Last thing we need to do here is take all of our chopped chocolate and then we're gonna fold it into our batter. Now, if you've never folded before, super easy. You just wanna scrape the edges of the bowl and then go towards the center. So we're going around and then through the middle. It's just a very gentle way of stirring. Okay, excellent. Okay, so now that we've got that ready, we're gonna go ahead and butter our pan and pour that into our pan. Now, one of the biggest secrets in doing something like this when you're not using a whole lot of ingredients is find the best ingredients you possibly can. The better the chocolate, the better your brownies are gonna be. Don't use, it may be tempting if you can't find dark chocolate or just wanna grab those chocolate morsels, don't use those because they have ingredients in there that keep them from melting and you want your dark chocolate to just melt all through your brownies. So good. Pour the batter into a greased pan and bake at 300 degrees for 45 minutes to an hour. I just put a pan of brownies in the oven. This pan I made last night, um, so we didn't have to wait around for the oven, but uh, I am so excited to get into these. I mean, what's not to get excited about? We've got nearly a pound of butter, a pound of sugar, a pound of chocolate in here, almost not quite a pound of each, but uh, oh my God. Mm. Oh my God. <laughs> I wanna cry right now. This is so good. Oh. I need a moment. This is, can you just see how intensely rich that is? Mmm, you gotta make this. This is like obscenely good. <laughs> Thanks for hanging out with me here at Lakeside Table today. And if you are obsessed with chocolate like I am, definitely stick around for the next video, which is my gluten-free chocolate torte with ganache. Fabulous. That is also in my cookbook, Lakeside Table Sauces. So go check those out, stick around for more videos, and I'll see you soon. Bye guys. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna be right here doing this. I'm, I got goosebumps right now. <laughs>